definitely about the digital. The digital okay. alpha has uh, the last the last prep tick I took was the digital one. So I I do like it. I like it because it's much faster. I don't have to waste time bubbling in. But I did hear a lot. My friend took it in September and she told me that um, there was a problem a lot with like the glare and like the screen and like so I'm like I'm just nervous like uh, how would how can I like really get ready for it? That's what I'm trying to say. Like, yeah, really sure. And those are, those are valid concerns. And so the digital LSAT, like anything else, there's a mix of pros and cons. Mm-hmm. I agree. The bubbling super fast. Now that's really nice. I also love how it grays out when you eliminate a choice and you exactly. can collapse choices that. also. Just like that, yeah, take it out awesome. completely. So I don't even have to work. I don't even have to look at them anymore. Just boom, they're out. I did enjoy that really much. Yeah, it's great. Now with the glare, it's a valid concern happens a lot. So when you first enter the test center on test day, you want to look up at the ceiling and see, are there harsh fluorescent lights? And they, I have glasses, you. so you know my glasses. Be- yeah. <laughs> so we oh, have to work on that. <laughs> exactly. I feel you on that, yeah. So when you walk in, check out the light situation above you. Check out how it reflects off the tablet screen the second they give you a tablet. Yeah. If it's that glaring a lot, ask the proctors if they can move you before the test starts. Don't wait till the timer begins before yes. saying, oh, this is actually an issue. <laughs> so that's the first thing you want to look exactly. out. Exactly. No, definitely. Now, there's supposed mm-hmm. to be a certain angle at which you hold the tablet. Enforcement of that varies. Some people mm-hmm. tilt it more than others. You'll see what enforcement's actually like and see what's considered okay. Mm-hmm. But ultimately, I would suggest if you can get moved away from where there's a light directly above you. Because that's oh, where no, the reflections yeah, happen. Exactly. The other thing is, With regard to the tablets themselves, I want you to be on the lookout for the highlighting and underlining functions. They're not that responsive with the stylus. And I don't think they're that useful anyway, honestly. And so- Yeah, I didn't use it at all. Yeah, the stylus was, reports were pretty universal that the stylus is not that great. So I would suggest not counting on that. Get ready to use your finger and (laughs) Don't trust you, that that can never fail you, right? And also, <laughs> exactly. um, don't really rely on the highlighting and underlining at all. I don't think they're that useful anyway. I would just do your work on the scratch paper on the side. Yeah, that's, that's when, I, when I took it um, on Sunday. That's exactly what I did. I didn't even bother pressing it. I was just like, um, although in, log- in, in the logical reasoning, I felt for some reason I didn't have to write anything. Like, like I told you, it was much faster. Like I get, I get like an extra few seconds on the questions because you don't have to bubble it in that um that it was just easier for me i got i think in one of the sections i got like 19 right and the other one i got 21 oh wow so that's I'm great like, yeah so i feel and but on the paper ones i always get like 18 17 so i'm like oh like i think it's like those extra few seconds and every single question that had give, given me a little boost so i definitely enjoyed that and i just feel like with the stylus and the highlighting it's just gonna get too too mess like too too much like I could just read, you know, and if if I understand what I read, I got it, you know. Thanks for tuning into the show. Please subscribe if you haven't done so already to be notified of new episodes as I release them and feel free to reach out if you need anything at all as you move forward with your prep. I'm happy to help however I can. In the meantime, I wish you all the best and take care.